hit the button. I did. All right, good. Hello and welcome to Game Soup. This is Barney of Isaac, episode three. I am Ed. This is Joe. And uh, I just refilled my coffee. You did too, but I've been really tired recently, even with all this coffee. It's because my cat keeps waking me up at like 6.30. Yeah. It's really lame. Yeah. So, I don't know, but you said you feed your cat at night, right? So it doesn't wake you up? No, no, we don't feed our cat. You don't feed your cat at night? <laughs> no. When do you feed him? No, we don't feed him. What do you mean? He doesn't eat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe that. Yeah. It might be true, though. Uh, should we do a new run? Sure. Are you gonna play as you? Play, you should play as one of the new characters that we unlocked. And we haven't even tried any of them. Yeah. Any well, of these guys? I've already played with this. This Azizou. one. This one. <laughs> Bless you. Azizou. This one can fly. This one, I don't know. I haven't played this. Azizou. Lazarus. That's like usually has to do with like rebirth or re re life, coming back to life from being dead, like zombie type of thing. So he's a zombie. Look at his dumb hair and his. Oh yeah, he's got a really. Uh... Let's smash up a little bit. Oh. Oh, you know what? Here. You'll die, though. No, I won't. Check this out. Wow. I read that... It's a... It's you a key. <laughs> <laughs> and then you push it into the spikes. Wow. Spot. I read that oh, yeah. you're guaranteed to get something as long as... If you get... If you get down to one half of a health, you get guaranteed to get something out of oh, that. Oh, really? So you really gotta... You pretty much just gotta kill yourself. Come on, keys. All these chests and no keys. Dude, this game has a lot of masochism things, like themes to it. Like hurting yourself to get power. Yeah, there's kind of like a dark, like a dark warlockish type of a uh, type of a thing, like a black magic thing. You yeah. know, Magic the Gathering like and drawing. like the black magic cards, like drawing make on you spirits. lose your life. So, did you ever play Magic the Gathering? What color did you play? <laughs> That's like a, a question that a lot of people who barely have played the game will ask what you. What color? Like, what color did you play? <laughs> I, I had a really, I had a really good green deck. My green deck was really good. Oh yeah, your green yeah, deck. I was really competitive in the in the seventh grade with my green deck. Sure. And green deck is what, like shaman or something in Hearthstone? I don't know. In Hearthstone, in, probably, it, probably not even comparable. The equivalent in Hearthstone, probably Druid is the most equivalent to a mono green deck. Mono, mono. You mean like mono. Princess Mono No K? Yes. Mono No 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 No. <laughs> mono No 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 K. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well. Oh yeah, oh. see Lazarus. He comes back to life hey. and he's bloodied. How did you How did you know? Because his name is Lazarus. Yeah, but haven't you ever Haven't you ever watched the Batman cartoon? I for real died though. Should I go again or do you? Yeah, go again. You barely had a turn. You I killed know. yourself. That was really unfortunate. Yeah, we should just erase this episode. We we'll just start no, over. No, don't start over. It's okay. been pretty good so far. I mean the. The talking is all right, but your playing is terrible. <laughs> I'm trying. Like, I can't even get in here. That was People are a... watching this to see pros. That was a really unfortunate. People are watching one, this to see us read pros and watch pros. Read pros? professional. Read like, pros. Yeah, read pros. Like, like uh, uh, you know, it's a little a terrible like the pun there. Poetry. Terrible pun. Sure, sure, sure. You know, I do know what you mean. So I don't agree with you. <sighs> Chinese food. <laughs> <laughs> We talked about it in our last episode. We talked about it in our Hearthstone episode, but I want to talk about it again. Is Chinese food health food? Apparently. I saw a headline, okay, in the newspaper. Okay. And the headline was, is Chinese food health food? The verdict is in. And then, uh, you know, I read the article, aka I skipped to page A6. A6. And looked at the end of the article. Yeah. To see if the thing, to see if the ver what the verdict was, the uh, verdict was, yeah, yes, <laughs> Chinese food is health food, all Chinese food, all Chinese food, so not even the vegetables, but like the egg rolls and the spring rolls and yeah, 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 especially spring rolls. Well, how, how, <laughs> how, how can that be health food? I don't know. It was in the newspaper, the local newspaper that I get. <laughs> I still get. You the, don't get a newspaper. I get the newspaper. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't make fun of. The newspaper. I don't make fun of newspapers on, on the regular basis. Nobody's seen a newspaper in 30 years. Yeah, no we're, one. We're pretty sure they don't exist anymore. I remember when I was growing up, my parents had a subscription to the newspaper, and there would be like newspapers around the house from like the last week. They would just be on the table, on the ends, on the end cap of the, you know, the end cap of the sofa. What do you call that? The armrest. The armrest. No, the the table next to the sofa. The, the end table. Yeah, the end table. <laughs> the end cap. Yeah, the end cap. <laughs> the end. Yeah, there you go. This guy's kind of murdering me. 
and they would just be everywhere, and I never read them. Was, they were so boring and difficult to well, read. Yeah. Why would you read a newspaper? They're so difficult to read. <laughs> Because guess. you have to turn to page A6 to get the full story. <laughs> always have I would to read it, and then A6. the pages are so big, and your little eight-year-old fingers trying to turn the page. I guess. I remember for a little while, I was cutting out the comic pages, though. Oh, yeah? Because like, I couldn't afford to buy enough comic books. I mean, that's really the best part I wanted of the... to read. I wanted to read... I loved comics. And I wanted to read all the comics, but, but those I, aren't those aren't the kind of comics you'd want to read, right? Not really. They're like Garfield. Yeah, I would. I settled though. You settled. Nowadays, you have so many comics, so many, so much content, so many uh, web comics and stuff. Like it's just all free, and you can. Everybody wants to give you their comic for free. Come on, give me. Just read my comic. You know, everybody wants you to read their comic. You know what my favorite web comic is? Two little bastards. Two little bastards dot com. I knew it. It's I knew really, you were say it's that. a really good. Comic. I haven't, it's really uh, funny. It's not not that many people know about it, but it's really funny. Yeah, I haven't. Uh, I haven't. I need to get caught up with it. Uh, was anything cool happened recently? Uh, it's it's still about that that sword guy, that skeleton guy. Oh, the undead swordsman. Yeah, 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 yeah. that guy. He's that's so, right. That's the name of the so character. He's so goofy. Yeah. He's funny, man. I love that comic. Like I love like I, XKCD is really good, of course. And uh, what's the other one? Oh, PBF. Yeah, Perry Bible Fellowship. Yeah. That's one. That's my second favorite. Yeah, Two Little Bastards is definitely out there. It's like definitely top three. It's up there. Um, what's this? Oh, there we go. This seems really hard. Maybe it's just me, but I haven't got any power ups. Two Little Bastards dot com. Oh yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah, and it's it's a number two though. So if you want to check it out, you gotta type in. Or is it? I think both work. Do they have it? Yeah. That's a pretty common thing to do, is to get both names, just in case. Yeah, yeah. The number two and the word Yeah, you pay an extra $7 a year for your domain name or whatever, right? Yeah, is that all it is now? I don't know, maybe. Maybe it's $10. What's up with all these flies everywhere? Everything that's electronic and internet-ish is getting cheaper and cheaper, and also yeah. with all this Bitcoin stuff now. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you guys, if you aren't, if you aren't buying things with the Bitcoins... Now, like you, it's, you know, you get you should get with it. Microsoft takes Bitcoin now, and so does um what Overstock, Tiger Direct, and uh, some New other. Egg. Oh, Time, Time Magazine. Like yeah, I ordered I ordered some from Newegg with Bitcoin. It was it was faster and easier than using a credit card. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, I wish I I wish they were doing that when I bought this computer about two years ago because I had to convert from Bitcoin to cash, wait for it to get in my bank account, and then use the cash. It was such a hassle. Yeah, it's getting way easier to do it now. Thank like God, I'm man. actually before I like. I don't know. I would like screw around with it a little bit just to ha like play around with Bitcoin, but now I like actually use it. Yeah, like it wasn't viable buy stuff. When it, anybody that offers to buy something with Bitcoin, I'll do it. I'll just buy it with Bitcoin because it's easier. Yeah. I mean, it has to be. Well, let's once, go through this. Once you get set up with it. Yeah. Uh oh. What the H? Oh, it opens when <laughs> you go off of it. That's kind of. That's kind of useful, I guess, in case you don't want to fall in it by mistake. You yeah. Know? You might walk in by accident. Curse of a labyrinth. So this is a giant cave area? Oh, okay, I... Yeah, I, these are big. The labyrinth ones are big. I remember this, these being really difficult. From last time. At least these aren't the ones that puke blood at you. They, yeah, they, they come shoot, later. They shoot platelets at you. What? They shoot what? Platelets. Platelets? Isn't that what they're called? Platelets? Like blood platelets? Yeah. <laughs> you never want to... You never life tap into those doors. I'll, I'll do it, do man. It. Do, come on, dude. It only takes a half a... Oh, yeah, you're right. How do you get through those? You probably need a bomb. You, you, don't have a bomb. you just touch it? I don't know, try it. Yeah, try it. Hey, it worked. Sort of. I guess it's just a pain thing, like everything else in this game. Oh, you gotta use that. You gotta use it. Telepills. I don't know where that I took think us. It, I think it ran... Yeah, it took you to a random spot, because there's, uh, there's some more up in the up in the top left in the map. There's oh, really? probably where you've been. So, oh, yeah, you're, this is a huge level. Yeah. If, if this is how big it is... Yeah, this is... The labyrinth levels are hard, and it doesn't seem like they lowered the difficulty of the rooms at all. It's just more rooms. Yeah, yeah. They're just huge. Like, there was that one with that long bridge, and there was some little guys around it. I don't know. I like this game. I think it's really cool. I, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not ready to give a verdict yet, because it's a roguelike. Yeah. You need at least, like, three hours of playing a roguelike before you can give a, a decent verdict. Unless it's, like, really terrible, but... but... Yeah, then you know right away, but... Especially a game like this. This game is, a, like, a huge following, you know? And... Oh, crap. Yeah, this seems, this seems like it would really appeal to, a. Come on! Pretty large group of uh, paralysis. What does paralysis do? 
We'll never know. I don't know. So weird. where are we? Let's go up here, I guess. Okay. Yeah, this game kind of appeals to. Do they still? Are they? They still got goth kids? Uh, no, they still they, thing. They don't have those anymore. <laughs> they, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. They don't, wait, does Hot Topic still exist? This is important. I think so. Yeah. This is important. Viewers, if Hot Topic still exists, send us an email and and pictures of Hot Topic and kids wearing Hot Topic clothing. This is important. Yeah, Hot Topic. They also steal artwork to put on there. They go on DeviantArt and just yeah. grab art. Did they still do that, or yeah. was that just like a one-time thing? Uh, I think they still do it. I don't know. That's really messed up. I wouldn't be. I mean, it's just a bunch of executives in a, in, a, in like a, a meeting room saying, "Oh, how can we appeal to the the, the hip hip Generation Z or whatever?" I guess Generation Z. Yeah, all Z those company, all those companies are fake. None of that's yeah. none of that's real. It's just it's funny. Because all this stuff is supposed to be like trendy, and, and but it's not. It's just a bunch of uh, older guys and, and gals saying like, "Oh, how can we make some uh, money?" Yeah, it's probably mostly guys trying to make money for their wives. No, <laughs> their wives at home that are gonna oh, nag them because they need a new, a new purse. Hey but man, they want to. They want their the outside of the house landscaped. So, uh, <laughs> so their husband's got to go out there and and steal the the Ninja Turtles logo and put it on a T-shirt. It's free though if you can steal it. So why not? No, I'm just or, kidding. Or make, a, or make a shirt that's a Nintendo controller that says old school or classically trained. Uh, oh, yeah, because it's very old school. <laughs> it's very hip and, hip and retro. Well, look, oh, oh. If, you're, if you're wearing that shirt right now, <laughs> take it off. Just take it off. I don't care where you are, what you're doing, take off that shirt. Or you can wear it. You know, like, oh. you can wear it if you want. If you think it's cool, you can wear it. You know? I Who guess. am I to judge? Because I was thinking about that the other day, how I said the other day how I bought the Slipknot album, the first oh, Slipknot yeah. album, on, the on week tape. it came out, on tape. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. And I was saying, well, you guys can stop listening to this show now because I was into Slipknot in my <laughs> youth. But, you know, to make fun of somebody for their music is... Yo, this guy will not die. It's, it's a hipster. It's kind of a hipster thing, and it's like... To make fun uh, of people? For their music, to, or? to make fun, of, yeah, to make fun of people that like something that's popular or something that's uh, something that considered you don't like. considered, yeah, something that you don't like. Yeah, but there's so many types of music, and so many things are 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 good to. They're for different people. They're exploding. You see this? You see wow. this? Wow. Yeah, you got wrecked there. Would you like to go next? You got wrecked. Do that, one more. That was horrible. I'm kind of on a roll here. You're not. I'm on, certainly not. You're not. But at I'm all. on a roll here. Yeah. I don't like this character. I'm gonna do another character. I'm gonna do... But it's... Yeah, the, the whole hipster culture is kind of gross. Yeah. It's not It's not really that, like, that we hate the way they look, the way oh. they, 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 they dress all weird because they don't have a personality and all that kind of thing. Like, the normal stuff. But I think the thing that really makes it bad is the negativity that's involved, which is kind of why I felt bad about saying that thing about... Well, well, what I just said about the take off that shirt, if you're wearing that classically trained shirt, I yeah. think it's stupid, but you know, if you like it, it's fine. Where you can wear it, you know, somebody might think, somebody else might think it's cool. Yeah. And the and the thing about, hey, you're gonna die if you get hit I'm on that die. spike again. You need to get down to a half a heart and come back. Now, this is a pretty extraordinary uh, uh, display of acceptance you're doing right here. I've never heard you say this before. And. Well, there's a, yeah, yeah, I was just thinking about, yes. like, the, well, careful, that's a troll bomb. Troll bomb. Yeah, I know, I like to make fun of things myself, but, no. uh... No, go on, though. But, uh, I'm still gonna continue, you know, making fun of things <laughs> that I think are, are dumb, but... Sure. But, uh, well, mainly things that are, like, fake and dumb. Whoa. Like, if you're wearing a classic... The, the guy who made the classically... The guy who, who decided to put that on the store shelves, he doesn't know anything about Nintendo. <laughs> Well, probably not. Now you're, you're probably I don't know right. anything about playing Nintendo games, but uh, he's just trying to make some money off you. But you know, if you like the shirt, is that really so bad? It. I mean, he provides a, a service to somebody that wants it and is willing to pay for it. You know, it could be worse. Is all I'm saying. You know, he's got a product. You got the money. You both end up happy. And I was saying about like, you know, you can listen to Slipknot. You could. I still put on that album once in a while. No. There's a couple songs on there. Yeah. Really? Yeah, because it's like you hear the, the old music like like Bad Bad Leroy Brown. You ever heard that song? Only a uh, first time today. Yeah. Oh. It's just like a song. You know, it's you have movies. a song that's that you listen to when either when you, yeah like when you were a kid. So that's like 
the first Slipknot album. Listen to that when I was a kid. My dad used to always have Bad Bad Leroy Brown. He had the oldies station on, so I heard Bad Bad Leroy Brown a ton of times. So you put on an old song that you've heard before, like. I wouldn't. I probably wouldn't get into that song or Slipknot now. Yeah. If I had, if I heard it now and it was, I'd never heard it before. I probably wouldn't be listening to it. But you know, it has like a place. It has a place for you. That's a really interesting contrast. You've got classical plus Slipknot. You listen to both of those. Things? Oldies, you like oldies music. Like yeah, oldies. Yeah, yeah I guess not, not, not on like a regular. Neither none of that stuff I listen to on a regular basis anymore. Right. But you know, it's. Uh, when I feel like listening to something that I'm familiar with and something something cool and old like that, that I was into before, I guess. That's what you would listen to. Yeah, I'm still it. I guess I'm still into it because I'll put it on once in a while. Just to put it on the playlist. Do you have like an iTunes playlist that you just have going all the time? No. <laughs> no, I'm an old man. I use VLC. That's okay. <laughs> v well, I don't, I don't particularly like VLC playlist functionality. No. I'm not very good. I mean, maybe it's just me. I suck at making it work correctly. I I have to fumble for like five minutes to get it to do anything. So, but I mean, iTunes is not any better. iTunes is like super resource hogging, and it's okay. The interface is definitely better. Resource but. hogging doesn't really matter that much. No, for unless you're using like a little laptop or something that's a few years old. But yeah, now computers, even laptops, are so fast that it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter that much. But I want like VLC is so lightly. I want stuff to load instantly. Like, yeah, I, I like I like that. That's my favorite kind of program. Is yeah. just a gray box that does what it's supposed to do. Like my favorite art program is Paint Tool S A I. Yeah, which is a gray box that you can make drawings with. Whoa. The tools work really well, and it's like three megabytes. The whole program. Yeah, that's and, unbelievable. And it has all kinds of paint. You can do watercolor and acrylic and which makes you think inks. like. What is Photoshop doing that takes up hundreds and hundreds yeah. and hundreds of megs? Yeah. Photoshop does a little. I mean, Photoshop probably from all the filters and stuff. Yeah, I guess so. Like paint, paint tool. All it, all you can do with it is draw. You can't put filters on anything. You can't. There's not. There's not really any bells and whistles. There's no vector drawing stuff. There's no. You can't put text in mm -hmm. even. But if you just want to draw. Yeah, that's what it's for. That's that's the main program that I use, and then I use Photoshop for like grunt work, like cropping and saving files in different formats and stuff. I hardly use Photoshop, really, except for grunt work now. I haven't used Photoshop recently, either. It, to me, it's just, it's really, like, you know, all those high-end uh, professional programs, of course, you know, they have to have a lot of features, but to me, they're really complicated. And, uh, it takes yeah, me you forever get to... so many menus. <laughs> like, yeah. I've been using Photoshop since, like, Photoshop, I don't know, Photo three or four. Photoshop is menus, the program. It's, <laughs> it's just menus. Yeah, yeah, there's so many, and they just keep adding and adding yeah. and adding. So, like, I know where everything is from the old days, and then uh, it's just, like, a couple new things, every new one, and I don't even get every new one anymore, though. I don't, I don't need it. <laughs> I use Photoshop 7 sometimes now. I don't even... Really? Yeah, I have 7 and seven. CS something. I don't know. CS 5 wow. or 6? I don't know. What are they? What are we up to now? I have who, one of them. Who knows, man? It doesn't matter. For what I, for what I do, I, yeah. don't, I don't need, I don't need the, the newest one, usually. Yeah. And that's actually what's so cool about Vegas, which is the video editor that I use. Like, it is a, it's a, it's a decent amount of menus, but they're all functional and it's really logical, which I can't say about Photoshop, at least for me. Photoshop seems logical to me, but maybe just because I've been using it for for a while, maybe like a decade now for a heart. Let's do it, brother Bob. But yeah, at first I do. I vaguely remember when I was learning Photoshop how you would like click stuff and nothing oh would God. ever seem to work. How you planned it to, like, you would try to yeah. do something that nothing seems to work. I've never gotten just past clicking that on point. something. Yeah. I'm still there. Yeah, yeah, I, actually, I kind of remember that now. That's what makes yeah, me... Yeah, it can be kind of frustrating, but now, like, it still happens. Once in a while, you'll do something, but it's almost always the layers. Sometimes it's something yeah. else, but it's almost always that you're just on the wrong layer. When that happens, I want to scream. It, but sometimes, yeah, it sometimes makes you just can't crazy. figure something out. Now I figure it out, like, right away, but... It's but yeah, when, when you don't understand what's going on, yeah. with Photoshop, there's like at least seven different ways you can do any task yeah. in Photoshop. Yeah. Photoshop talk for you guys. You it's, guys, it's, all you guys listening. If you're actually listening to this, email me. You know, pat yourself on the back. If you're listening to this, if you're still listening to this, email me, joeydangerous at gmail.com. I still use that old handle for my email. What will you give them? Prize uh, or something? Or just recognition. If you're the first one to email me about this, I'll send you some stickers. I make stickers and sell them. That's right. like one of my businesses. There so I'll, Free stickers. If you, if you send me 
If you send me uh, your your home address or whatever your mailing address is, I'll send you some free stickers and tell them that you were watching the Binding of I the I <laughs> the Binding of I snin 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 Isaac the Binding of Isaac right video. Yeah, free stickers. Yeah, free stickers. In fact, you, yeah. Joeydangerous at gmail.com. Yeah, All right. in fact, you have stickers for pretty much, pretty much everything, right? For pretty much like every anime. Well, all, yeah, the, all make, the popular stuff. Like, yeah, I make some fan art type of stickers and some original stuff and whatever. Tell me what you like and maybe I've yeah. drawn that character or something. I would say there's a good chance. If it's from like popular media, you've probably drawn it. Like video games, anime, everything. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea, man. Ooh. Yeah, we should give out prizes for people who watch the show. For the fans. Oh god, oh god. Yeah, if oh I god. get too many requests, I probably wouldn't do it. But I doubt I'll get one, so... No, we'll see. Also, if you go on our store, my store... I got a bunch of stores, but the, <laughs> there's, uh... 57media.storeenvy.com Store Envy, that there's only one E in the middle there. S T O R E N V Y 57media.storeenvy.com. I don't know if I have our, I don't know if I have a Game Soup coupon on there. I set up a Game Soup on our, on my, uh, on our Etsy store. Oh! Oh, good going. So there's a little plug for you. This has been pretty uneventful. Sorry, my hands are kind of like. This game makes me tense. If you go to etsy.com slash shop slash 57 media store, use promo code GAMESOUP to get 10% off. Alright, I'm gonna give it a shot. Now do Joe's it. on the controller. Um, you don't have to play as this guy, of course, you can do whatever. What is this guy? Kane? I don't know. He's got, I think, average stats. He's got two of everything. Like, two attack, two speed. What other... What's Matt? Have we tried her yet? No, she's got a lot of health, though. Alright. Try it. No, that, she looks suicidal. That double shot was really cool. Look, you start with the heart item. I don't know what that does. I think she's slow. Feels kind of slow, but maybe not. Maybe it's just because you had the speed power up and I'm used to watching you play with the speed power up. Oh, this game's fun. Oh, wow, controls like a dream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. So, yeah, I was just saying, you know... The thing about... And the thing... Okay. Here's the other thing about hipsters that that I that's really the the bad part about it that I don't like is that most of them haven't created anything themselves and they judge everyone else. They judge everyone who's created things. Like kind of what we're what like we review games but like okay, we're not like we're not we're not criticizing. We're not we're we're being uh we we're giving constructive criticism. Right. We're not just tearing somebody down like Oh, you like the Binding of Isaac? Oh, I liked it when uh, I liked it when it was a flash game, when it was a shitty flash game. <laughs> you know, that's not a good argument for it. Yeah, yeah when it was a <laughs> shitty flash. Game. I liked it when it sucked. Only in the back of your head. Yeah. I bet you shoot out the back of your head. Yeah. Actually, yeah, because it's tears, right? That's actually pretty neat. Eyes in the back of your head. Isaac's in the back of your. Okay. So that's that's really the, the bad part about about them is that they they have, they they're mostly people that haven't accomplished anything. I don't know. I mean, you think? And they're, that's a pretty bold statement. They're bitter about. Uh, I don't know. That's a pretty bold statement as well. They're bitter about You're it. You're just full of them today. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't really talked to anybody who identifies as a hipster. It, most don't people much. don't identify as it. Yeah. Nobody's gonna admit that they are that. Well, don't they want to be the original? So they will. Maybe not. He's coming for you. Is he coming for it? No, he's oh, doing he's this. Hoo -hoo. You have your rechargeable too. I'm not sure what it does, but you could, could you might want to use it in this fight. Just to... Oh, it gives you a heart. Oh, it does? Wow. Oh, that's yeah, cool. so you can... Uh, oh, that's like a heal. Then. Yeah, marginally heal. Alright. Yeah, I was watching that instead of dodging. It's alright. Oh, come on. So, I shouldn't it, be getting hit by that easy. In my efforts to heal you, I got you uh, more injured than ever. You're limping around. You're also naked. Yeah, every character in this is naked. Just about, right? At least I know where the hitboxes are. Yeah, right. Oh, I thought he was gonna charge me there. He has three attacks. He seems to do the one where he shoots at you. Oh, come on, why did I dodge that? I almost got hit. I was gonna say he hasn't charged in a while. Okay, we got him. Get some free hearts. Dog food. HP. Dog. <laughs> dog Dinner. Food. It was dog food. 
That can be dinner. You know what? I heard something amazing, which is that all cat and dog food in, in the U.S. has to also be edible for humans. Have you heard that? I don't really? know if it's true, but legally, like if you were stranded and all you have was a, a canned cat food, it might last another day. Hmm. That's interesting to know. I don't know if it's true or not, but it's... Have it's, you ever eaten uh, cat food, like canned cat food? No, I've never been in that position. I've never been stranded on, on an island with just a can of cat food and nothing yeah, else. Yeah, the, the tuna's pretty good. Isn't it just tuna? Yeah. It was just a can of tuna. It's like red, though. No, you you just ate a can of tuna. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> that is cat food, technically, I guess, but... Gold door. Should I go yeah, in Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, show. Look, you got a PhD, so you're going to identify all the pills you get. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Better oh, pills. Pretty it's fly. A... That probably just summons a fly. There you go. Yeah, it does. Yeah, PhD is great to have in real life, too, but also in this game. It's more useful in real life. I heard you have to have an IQ of at least 125 to get a master's degree. I don't believe that. I think anybody can get a master's degree. Really? Yeah. What yeah, does your IQ have to do with it? I'm gonna shoot out the back of my head. <laughs> it's kind of slow. Uh, it is slow, isn't it? Yeah. It seems a little slower. I think anybody can get the uh, get the degree if they work hard enough in school. I don't know. I think intelligence has something to do with it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm... I'm sure it does. I mean, you have to have a certain amount of intelligence to acquire you the, have a the knowledge, right? What the? F Good luck. Uh, at least the the hitboxes on these. Oh, oh, come on! A game around the corner there. Yeah, the graphics make it look like you're gonna get hit if you stand next to them. Whoa, whoa! This is a uh, perilous man. Perilous. Where am I supposed to even? I don't know. Jesus. The boss room is upper right. There it is. Let's Here. just go for it. Yeah. Cause I'm not coming back through that room again. Oh, good. It's this fight. That was an interesting room. Right? Yeah. This game is continues to be interesting. But this is a freshly patched version as well, so maybe maybe there's new rooms associated with this patch. Oh really? Yeah. Did they add more to the game? Maybe. I I read the patch notes briefly. I'm pretty sure it's mostly bug fixes. Right. But I think there is some there was definitely some balancing as well. Yeah. That would be surprised. Yeah, this game's it's it's pretty neat. It's a pretty cool game. And we've barely even scratched the surface. We've already put a couple hours into it. Good coffee. But as I was saying, to harshly judge judge media without ever having created media yourself and put yourself out there. Yeah, it's not it's not a fair thing to do. Yeah. Right. Like you don't you don't know how much go like even to make a bad game. They're still better than you at making games. Yeah. Like if you've never made a game before, if you've never made whatever your media, whatever your your media is, movies or let's plays, even even let's plays have you know some some level of of putting yourself out there and well, I think the, some level of art art to it. I think there's an important distinction here, and it, that is to say, like if you if you play a game that you genuinely don't like, you're allowed to not like it, opinion wise. You can say subjectively, I don't like this game. Yeah. But not make fun fine. of somebody else that that uh, that likes right. it because it's yeah yeah that's I mean that's sort of like a it's definitely some sort of fallacy. What fallacy could that be? You know, like somebody else is is ob objectively worse than you because of their interests. Yeah yeah yeah. It doesn't, yeah. It doesn't make oh, any sense. Oh, uh... that's it's it's not is it ad hominem? No, it's, it's I think so. Something like I mean, that. It's like attacking the person instead. Yeah, of, instead of it's like I mean it's it's completely fallacious. Whatever it is. Um. Yeah, so it's, it's it's definitely not a good thing to do, but there's a fine line between judging a game and and you know, like like you said, having not created a media anything in that in that industry right. and still or any it. yeah or anything at all really yeah like and even somebody who makes a bad game is gonna have a better perspective on on what it takes. It's like or like um, let's see you or maybe somebody likes a movie that you don't like. Or you recommend a movie to, to a guy, and then he says, "Oh, but you well, you like the Transformers movies, so you you can't possibly have good taste in music <laughs> or good taste in movies, right?" That's kind of a, that's a wacky thing to say. I oh. like the oh yeah, I like the Transformers movies. And you might just be a person that likes Transformers, but also likes like every other genre, you know? Like just because you like one movie doesn't say anything about the rest of the films that you like. You could have a really awesome taste and just happen to like that film too, you know? Not that that, that means you have bad taste, but you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I've correlate. seen all those movies. I think I don't think I saw the second one, actually. The new one, though, with the dinosaurs, that was awesome. Mark Wahlberg? Yeah, who's I didn't, a, who is that? 
Mark Wahlberg? Is he the main guy in that? Yeah. I don't. I don't know any actors' He's names. A... I, I don't know any actors or actresses' names. It's it's discount Ben Affleck, right? Sort of. I don't know. Mark Wahlberg. He was in The Departed. Yeah, maybe. He's like an eternally I don't, looks I don't eternally know, angry. I, I don't remember. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think yeah, that's ben, the guy. Yeah. yeah. He just looks like Van Affleck a little bit, and he's kind of angry. So. Oh my god, these guys are, these guys are rough. He's no, chopped. chops. You haven't taken any. Well, I shouldn't jinx it. You're doing good. They just have a lot of HPs. I needed some power-ups yeah. here. We need some DMG up. There you go. Look, dog bun, just what you wanted. You got dog food last turn. Oh, I should Snack. be using my my hearts. I guess I don't yeah, really need them you don't though. Need it. Might as well save it. Yeah, I'm a pretty slick, dude. <laughs> yeah, oh, here we go. Slick, Here's where dude. I can. Yeah, go for it. Oh yeah, just do what What's I did. This pink one. I don't know. If you go into the oh, it shoots you. Yeah, if you go into a diagonal, you might not even get hit. I can see forever. Use that. Use that, and then grab the other one. Yeah, that's gonna show you all the secret paralysis. I'm guessing that just freezes everything else in the in the room. But see forever shows you all the secret rooms, which is what we really want. We want to get those secrets. Jesus. Whoa. Good dodging. Ooh. There you go. Get that cash, man. Get that cash. Where do I want to? Didn't you say I wanted to go somewhere? Uh, no. Did I? Mm, maybe not. I'm gonna take you down to Chinatown. Is that where you want to go? I like Chinatown. That's one of the more interesting places that you can go around. Here. I'm yeah. I'm so glad every major city pretty much has a Chinatown. It's like, that's probably one of the greatest treats you can do, just walk around Chinatown for a couple hours. When I was in Japan, there was a Chinatown in... <laughs> really? In yeah. Japan? I'd rather... I... Oh God, I can't remember what, what uh, train stop it was. It was, um... How was it? It was there? Yokohama. Yokohama, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I've never been there. And it was gigantic. It's, it's, it's definitely rivals Philadelphia's Chinatown, and it's probably bigger. Which is weird for Japan, a place like Japan where everything is compact. It was fantastic. Like the same, uh, the same types of stores where you walk in and everything is just splayed out and like not marked in it. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's I don't know how such to a weird that. part of Chinese culture. Yeah, it's like how would you culture. describe those stores? <laughs> it's a mess. They're, well, they're like American Chinese. Huh? Well, no, they're not. I don't know. Plus, Chinese food is American food anyway. So, bootleg Pokemon cards. I guess. Bootleg everything, pretty much. Uh, maybe it's I don't know. Maybe that's an Asian way of, uh, a more Asian way of, uh, setting up your shop or something, you know, other stores in Japan were similar, I guess. Don Quixote? Yeah, Don Quixote. Uh, if you don't know what Don Quixote is, it's sort of like, it's sort of like a, like a flea market in a store, would you describe it? It's, it's sort of like a discount outlet. Where they I guess. Just, they have everything you could ever think of, just randomly strewn about. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. They have everything from like uh, food and clothing, and I think they have clothing. It's been a long time since since I've been in I one. I think so. They're they're fun. They're just fun to just walk around. You find all kinds of cool toys. It's been some time. I remember there was one floor. There was like the second floor was like there was it was like musical instruments, Game Boy games, and porn <laughs> on, on the, the second floor. floor. Yeah. Oh, well, hey, man, they gotta be uh, efficient with space. I mean, it, sure, it might insult a few people or, you know, uh, <laughs> or whatever. It's it's just real random, though. There's, yeah. It, there's not really even sections, except the top floor, I think, had all the really expensive stuff. And the bottom floor seemed to have more food than the other floors. <laughs> I wonder how they ever find anything. Oh, yeah, it's because their clerks aren't jerks. <laughs> That's how, because they can actually talk to the people that work there. Yeah, they ha they have it memorized. <laughs> it's like you know, it's how I run my my online business. Whenever I, whenever I sell something, I know where it is. It's yeah. somewhere in the house. <laughs> I don't have, and I always know exactly where to go to find it. But if somebody else had to work for me, no way, yeah, and figure out where the item was and how to pack it up, forget it. Yeah, no, they won't. Bomb, 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 battlefield. Yeah, if you're ever sad and you wanna listen to Bob on Battlefield. Yeah, let's just listen to Bob on Battlefield, and you. That's that's not corn. That is money. That is money. Money is corn. The band. With a. That's what this game sort of reminds me of. Like it. Like yeah. Like the modern. 
instead of uh, listening to corn, they're playing this game. I do see that. Like this kind of embodies corn specifically. No, me, maybe not. It's just like that that genre, that, yeah, like that the dark. Thing. Yeah, I don't know. Like the brooding the and dark sort brooding. of the music, even like yeah, the, the weird noises and like the heavy bass. Oh, you have a key. You have three keys. You should go in there. Right. Also, there's a question mark on the room to your right. I don't know what that yeah. is. Robo baby. <laughs> Friends till the. Mzzt. Yeah, there was our next one. Oh, down, oh down. no, you're right. You're right. I just haven't been in this one yet. Oh, yeah, it's the same room up there. Yeah. Alright. You also missed a room two rooms back. I don't know if you care. Whoa. Alright. Okay. That seems powerful. Sort of like laser gun and metal slug. Laser gun. That's. What's going on here? Infinite range. I don't think I can. I don't think I'm hitting. Or maybe I am. I'm like real distracted here. Yeah. There you go. I have 13 cents. Kind of need the heart. I wonder why that's red. Of all things. Maybe because you're supposed to buy it. Maybe. I don't know. Look at that face on that guy. <laughs> Oh man, look at all those hearts and those bombs. You can try to blow them up. Yeah, I guess I should do it. But well you don't need the hearts. Yeah, do you? Do. You do? Oh, okay. Oh, you do. But no blah, 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 blah. you should do it like pretty far away or else they might just explode. Oh yeah. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good enough. Yeah, there you go. Worth it. The screen's kinda dark, isn't it? Is that just me? I think it might just be a dark level, maybe? Yeah. It's a dark game. Oh, that's really rare. Soul hearts, I think, is what they're called. Hmm. I don't know, white hearts. They're like a... I have a little piece of a white heart at the yeah. end. Yeah. Oh, that just sucks. You just you have in. to go around it, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's not that. That's not too hard. No, nah. this game really has a lot to it. This is a really long level, too. I don't... How could this have been done by one man? I don't think it was. Yeah. I don't think this version was, at least. Polycephalus? This is a new... I haven't seen this boss before. Yeah, I haven't either. Well, I guess I definitely wouldn't have because I've only played it over here on Game Soup. Over here at the studio. Game Soup studio. Yeah. I like this. I like this... this uh, <clears throat> the studio that we got. It's kind of tiny. But it feels like home. Almost. <laughs> yeah, almost. Yeah. It's almost. Yeah, it is almost like a home, yeah. Yeah, and the, and the rent's really cheap on the studio. Yeah, I, you know, I'd be happy to sleep here, some nights, yeah, just to get. Yeah, some you work have done. just to get yeah, just to get some work on this game game soup. Yeah, I, I was doing a, a lot of video editing when the editor was out sick. He was gone for about four or five days, I guess, and I was pretty much stuck here. I spent I think yeah, two we, nights. Yeah, we thought we thought he might have uh, driven off a bridge. He was really depressed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he wasn't that bad. Just going through some stuff, you know. That was just the most generic thing I could have said. <laughs> He's just going through some stuff. Yeah, just ignore just it. Going through It'll a can of the problem will go away. Just going through a jar of peanut butter. He's going through the car wash. You know. Going. Through I need more. Water. I need more shot power here. You sure do. That's really all you need right now, and then you'd be set for the entire game. You need serious damage up. This guy is kind of kind of a jerk. Not really letting me get any hits on him. Ow. Oh. Yeah. No, I gotta kill I gotta kill this worm. Why the worm is really yeah. gonna be more dangerous than oh, the actual. Why did guy. he summon this worm? Yeah. Why does he gotta summon these ads? <laughs> he summons one ad. Yeah. He summoned two so far, but I Oh did he? I've, I've vanquished Whoa. Them all so far. Yeah. I was thinking about Silhouette Mirage the other day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That game's really fun. I don't it's think I've... one. I don't think I've ever actually played it. I've, I think I've seen you play it, and I've watched videos online. But I haven't actually played it. Yeah, there's a boss that you have to fight. He's like a, like a wizard. You fight him in the middle of the desert. And he summons an avalanche. In the desert? Yeah. Of course. Yeah, it's like a snowstorm. Because why not? Okay. Does and it... then uh, my, my favorite attack is when he summons a battleship. In the desert? Yeah, he summons like a naval cruiser. 
Is and it, uh, it doesn't like shoot its guns at you or anything or attack you. He just tries to drop it on you. <laughs> and then, it, then it disappears. It blows up or something. I don't know. Way to make good use of your assets, jerk. Don't use the ship so for So there's anything. like some naval ship just in a... What's that? You have to blow it up? Maybe. Maybe. Try it. Oh. Multiple bombs? It must be it's really gotta be good. Worth it. Gotta be worth it. I mean, I've already put that much into it. Uh, Maybe you can rest here and gain your hearts back or something. Yeah, but you're at full health. Yeah, so that wouldn't so, even matter. Keep this in mind. You'll probably have to come back here. You probably Doom. want to come back. Yeah, speaking along that line, what's the craziest boss you've ever seen in a game? Because this it's game is up there. Is certainly, yeah. Uh, this game is certainly also. Whoa. So they they shoot there. they drop a random thing out of them. Yeah, this game's like there's so many things we haven't seen yet. Yeah, well, yeah, we've probably seen like less than less than five percent of this game. Yeah, there's we're still seeing different enemies. Judgment. I don't know what that does. Sort of. <laughs> all right, give him all your money. He must give you something. What? <gasps> he shit out a troll bomb. <laughs> he killed himself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wonder if that happens every Whoa. time, or if it's a different thing every time. I don't know. But look if how fast you're killing this guy. If this isn't an advertisement for this game, I don't know what is. What are these things? Yeah, I don't know. I don't think we figured that out. I think we were trying to figure that out on the last episode of Game Soup Plays the Binding of Isum Map. <laughs> this game never ceases to amaze. Whoa. Ooh. You know, it's a really cool boss in... I've been playing Dark Souls 2 recently. There's a really cool boss in that game called the Executioner's Chariot. And it's a guy on a, on a, on a chariot, you know? He's got these horses in front, he's riding the horses around. It's sort of like a, it's like a circular arena. He just does laps around it the entire fight. And your goal is to kill him, right? So you get, <laughs> you get halfway through the fight, you end up pulling down this gate. Which, uh, which, you know, so you can't go, you can't make a full circle anymore, and he ends up crashing into it, and then you actually battle the horse and not the guy, and you realize it's because the battle is called Executioner's Chariot. So the boss is the horse that's carrying the guy and the, uh, the, the chariot. It's a really weird fight. Yeah, that is weird. It's really interesting, though. It reminds me of the goat fight from Majora's Mask. A lot. That's sort of, that's sort of a similar fight. There's only so much you can do in a certain, I guess, in a certain genre of game. Yeah, but like like this game seems to do everything that, <laughs> that like a twin stick shooter and a Zelda type of game can do, though. No, we can't. I mean, there's so much of this game we haven't even seen yet, so who knows? I think. I think you, that the laser gun goes through the. Yeah, it does look like it, but it seems really weak. Yeah, it does. Whoa. Yeah, I don't. I just yeah. don't have a great setup for these brain guys to take them out quickly. I can take them out, but it must hurt to get cried on the brain. Get oh, I got tears on my brain. At least yeah. not. I, th I don't think your brain has any nerves. It doesn't. No, I don't think so. Like if somebody were to. Oh, I can't even think about this. If you were to like get get some brain surgery and somebody accidentally poked your brain, you wouldn't feel anything except for. You'd lose all your, I don't know, probably lose consciousness or your memory or something. I only got two cents, so I guess I don't do anything. I got a key, though. Yeah, go, 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 go. What is that? George, does it say chili? Thunder thighs. <laughs> Thunder thighs. So it said you feel stompy, HP up, plus speed down? I think I'm slower, yeah. What is stompy? Maybe you can walk on, guys. Yeah, I think, look, I think I got, I think the, look, I think the body's fatter on the character. <laughs> it's not too bad. It seems fine. I can shoot through walls with this thing. With this laser gun. Some of these items, it's questionable whether they're even good. I mean, some of them are clear downgrades, but a lot of them I just don't know. It's a little hard to tell. Okay, I'll keep going. So we were talking about how this game is... You, you're more using your lizard brain when you're playing this game. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's more just reacting to things. It's definitely not high-functioning brain. Yeah, you're using, yeah. like, your low... Like, we're with Hearthstone, you have to use it. Oh, oh. <laughs> that's, that's what Stompy is. Okay, oh. I was I was wondering if I would break that bomb out or if I would get hit. I got hit. Wow, right. you're doing really well. Good. Huh. You can't put out the the blue ones, right? Mm, I don't think so. 
Maybe you can stomp on him. I guess I can give it a shot. Nah, don't. don't. No, it hurts you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll try anything. We're still... I think you're in the phase of learning, and I think that might be part of why this game is fun, is because you're in the learning phase for so long. Yeah. And the learning phase of a game can be really fun. The knowing every, the knowing almost everything and the higher strategy phase of playing a game can be fun, too. Like, where we're at in Hearthstone now, but, like, I remember learning how to play Hearthstone, just putting every card on the board and yeah. just seeing what happens. It's yeah. really fun. Yeah. You're not good at the game, but you have a lot of... I just have a lot of fun experimenting with what works and what doesn't. And eventually you learn what works and what doesn't. You read some articles and then you become more competitive in the game. But at first, it's just throw everything... Throw everything out there and see what happens. Yeah, that's the most fun. I don't know. I think it, I think all... I think... I think being good at... Once you're good at the game and, and, and winning, being able to... To be smarter than another dude is, is really like one yeah. of the main draws of playing a strategy card game, or really any one-on-one, -on -one, uh, any game really, yeah. any competitive game. Oh, winning is definitely fun too. Yeah, but I mean, the most fun I've had with Hearthstone recently was just when GBG came out, just because there were yeah, all these new cards. New, play, yeah, it didn't even matter. I just threw everything I could get. Right. In my, yeah, you kind of kind of goes back to that a little bit. Yeah. Except that you still you understand the basic mechanics of yeah. the game, but you still you don't understand what cards are like. Everyone thought Sneed's Old Treader was going to be the best <laughs> yeah. card, and it's pretty good, but it's not in every deck. Um, and yeah, why it's only it, in a few decks. Why is that? Do you know? Yeah, it turned out Doctor Boom was the Doctor Boom was, was the, the one. one. Yeah. Yeah, I, th I thought Sneed's Old Treader was going to be the best neutral legendary, but oh. Look at this guy. What else has surprised everyone? Shield Maiden? Yeah. 5-5 five, five that gives 5 armor? It seems it seems so underwhelming, to me at least, nah. when I first saw it, but... I mean, it's it's plain, it doesn't do anything wacky, but I don't know, I like it. Yeah, it really, a lot. Yeah. it's a lot better than expected. And, uh, oh, probably the biggest one is the uh, Antique Heal Bot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's in every deck. 3-3 three, three, gain, aim life, you gain 8 life. All the time. Yeah, it's in, yeah, like anything that's not aggro, pretty much. I have a, I have one of my shaman. And... You should probably just kill this guy because he's gonna spawn infinite flies. Yeah, looks that way. Yeah. So I'm just I'm kind of using my lizard brain here, and then I'm talking with my higher brain. That's what we were talking about this earlier off the show. Yeah. So what what you mean is you don't have to do any real complex mental tasks when you're playing this game. Yeah. Your your lizard brain, which is actually pretty complex, does it for you. You don't really you're not really thinking about it with your the top part of your brain. You're thinking about it more with like your gut your body and the lower part of your brain. Yeah, it's pretty simple to process. So you can be free to talk about other things. You can have two different conversations and play this game at the same time or something. Right. Oh, that's the boss room. Oh. <clears throat> There's still one more guy. It sure is. What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> there you go. I still have this coffee. It's going to get cold. Yeah. The gate? I haven't seen this one. Nor have I. What does he look like? He looks like something. Does he? Yeah. He looks like Exor. He does? Yeah. Maybe a little. Whoa! Oh. Some riding. Riding 2 shit there. Yeah. <laughs> Remember that? The, the laser two. gun? The laser in that? Riding 2, no. Oh. Have I played Riding 2? I don't know that. Maybe. I don't know. It's a really famous schmuck game. It used to be in like every arcade. Whoa. And there was an attack in that game that looked like that. I wonder if he takes more damage when his mouth is open. He's got some eyes in there. He's got some hit points on him. Sure does. But yeah, this game, it's it's a very visceral game. Yeah. Like the the visuals and the gameplay. Yeah, very different from Hearthstone. Yeah. You don't it's have kind to of the opposite too much. Though. Hearthstone. Hearthstone is all upper brain, and this is this is like lower brain and stuff, which is good. Because a lot of times when we play Hearthstone, we just get into it, and don't talk about anything else. Yeah. And, well, and another thing, a lot of people uh, will like downplay the lower brain, the lizard brain, as if it was like a lesser thing <laughs> than than it than you as 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 if like your body and your lizard brain are less important than your upper brain. Yeah. Like, things that use your upper brain are better. You're more sophisticated if you're if you're thinking with your upper brain more, but uh, the lizard brain is older. Yeah, it's older than the than the upper brain, and it actually knows more. It can process and know things faster than your higher brain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And your your lower brain keeps your 
your body alive. Like if you lost part of your sure. lower brain, you would die because sure, your heart has that too. Yeah, I mean it, it's responsible for basically keeping your heart pumping and keeping the rest of your body running smoothly. Like your higher brain has a lot less to do with that. Your higher brain is more just about sensing things and thinking things through. Yeah, and so. and your your lower brain and your your body they give you your your feelings. Yeah, your, your feelings your are really important. Emotions. They're yeah. really important information. You can your upper brain should take those into account. You don't want to use that, do you? To get a to get a half. Hour. I have one key. Yeah, I only have one key. Yeah, you're right. Probably don't. You know, it's really amazing. Uh, I I learned that there, there's a there's a picture you can find online. It's I'm sure you can find it pretty pretty easily on Google, where it shows a a map of the brain, and it shows what parts of your body are connected to what parts of your brain. It's like a little graphic, you know. So it says, you know, on the right hemisphere at the front is is uh, related to your arms, or you know, your your fingers, or or your neck, or your ears, or something. So every part of your brain has a different. Uh, it's sort of connected to one part of your body. As far as didn't you use that brain. as a as a graphic in in one of the long forms on did this I? on uh, this channel? Maybe I did. I don't remember. I think you did. It might have been the first one. I don't remember. First or second one, maybe? First or second long form. Yeah, that's that's really fascinating, too, because there's so much we don't know about the brain. The brain is, like, the final frontier. I know it sounds ridiculous, but and maybe a little cliche, but I think it's true. We know a lot more, you know, like, <laughs> we've been... What about space? The ocean, space... I mean, we've explored... We've explored local space, I guess, but, I mean... We can do all and that. And what about the ocean? They've got those those fish at the bottom with the giant mouths and at least we've the lights seen those. and stuff. Oh, gross. The crazy thing is we don't know anything about our own brains. We don't know how They're they so work. scary. We don't know why we sleep. Basic stuff. Go ask the smartest man in the world why people have to sleep. He doesn't know. Nobody knows. I thought you're the smartest guy I know, so why don't you, t why don't you tell me? I'll tell you. Nobody knows. Darn it. Oh, no, uh, I don't have any more of these freebie hearts. Uh, uh, I wonder how you recharge. I wonder if you have to kill a guy to recharge, or if it's just per room or something. Yeah, I don't know. I've oh. been trying to remember to use it. You're so close to the arcade. Don't yeah, die. The arcade. I love arcades. Yeah, you have to make it to the arcade alive. You really need some better damage, though. Yeah, this damage is pretty awful. This has been a, a little bit of a slow run because of that. I just I think. keep turning around. <laughs> whoa, uh -oh. whoa, 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 whoa. Close. Gotta use my higher brain. Yeah, I think a lot of a lot of people get too much into their upper, into their into their head. So there's like a, a phrase. I don't remember the phrase though. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's it's more fun to think with your higher brain, I guess. I don't know. I mean, that's why people like puzzle games. You know, it challenges them. Ooh. It's it's good to see different stuff unique and creative. These tears ideas. are so slow. Yeah, they are. They just keep turning around. Yep. Oh god. They're sort of sporadic with their movement. Yeah. All right, I got a key. Let's get to this arcade. Maybe I can earn a heart. Yeah. Oh, I have. I can. Uh, oh, can get a heart. Cool. So what's this? Okay, hearts for coins. Yeah. You should probably definitely get some hearts for coins. No, no, no. I think no? it's hearts to get... I trade hearts oh, and get coins. No, you don't want that. What's no. the fortune teller? I don't think I've ever seen that before. <laughs> it blows up and gives you a oh. crystal ball. I can see the future. You're trading that for the heart. The hearts, though, yeah. I don't know if you want to do that. No, nah, I don't really want to. I think it gives you a piece of the map or something. Oh. I can see forever. That? Uh, that, yeah. Hey, look. Secret room. Cool. Okay. Whoa. Surprise! <laughs> Greed. You can. Oh, I was gonna say you can stand right behind those rocks and can't get to you, but you have your laser. Yeah, it's so slow. Oh, it's a, yeah, it doesn't look like that's gonna really work. Nah, I can sort of hide back here while I'm taking out the ads. The ads. He summoned some ads. Whoa, Ooh, that was close. Yeah, you know, I think earlier when I was playing, I think the first round I was playing on hard mode. Oh, really? Yeah. Today? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't that know. That first round, that was about two seconds long. So when I started the second round, I noticed that it was set to that. So I don't know. Yeah, he just keeps summoning ads, and they don't go yeah. away. He doesn't, like, wait till the <laughs> till the old ones are dead. So. No. This is pretty hard. 
At least they don't hurt. All they do is jump slowly towards you. It's not, yeah. not too bad. Not like those uh, those flies that just fly through frequent, just a consistent pace. They just touch you and kill you. There you go. He's getting there. Oh no. Got hit by a stray bullet there. Oh, come oh. on. Tried to dodge. That sucks. Tried to dodge the middle bullet and dodged into the side bullet. Oh, you really dodged a bullet there. I did dodge one bullet. You dodged one. You want to go again? No, I want you to do one. All right. I really like this intellectual conversation we're having. I don't want to... I want intellectual? To a different character. Well, it's something. Maybe not. Oh, well, let's see. I guess, yeah. It's, it was a conversation. Eve. Samson. Did we do this one? A lot of hit points. I don't think so. I wanted to give him a, give him a shot. Let's, let's try it. Give him a go. Give him a go. Give him a little switch of room. Is his head spinning around? Like that? Yeah. Yeah. See, they call him Spinnyhead. Dot com. The Pope. Spinnyhead dot com. The Pope. It's called a miter. You feel blessed. Meaning? Meaning? Hmm. What could it possibly do? You know, I pulled up a, a wiki page of all the items. Things. It does seem like it. Maybe that's just one of his innate abilities. Hey, how do you get in there? I like how it, like, change, everything changes your appearance, and there's so many different things that change your appearance. Yeah. Come on. Seriously. How do you get in there? Oh, uh, this looks bad. They shoot at you, don't they? The music no. in this game also reminds me a little bit of Charlie Murder. You ever seen that game before? No. Uh, I, I played... What is it? I don't I played through that. It's another indie game. Is I played it on the Xbox, yeah. It's a brawler. Oh. I haven't heard of it even. It's by the oh, same crap. the same guys that did Dishwasher Samurai. I don't know if you've heard of that one either. <laughs> Dishwasher Samurai. Yeah, that was one of the earlier not. Xbox indie games. I have not heard of it. Is it any good? Charlie Murder is good. There we go. I didn't play that much of the Dishwasher Samurai, so I don't, I don't want to judge that one. Oh, Jesus. You know what's pretty crazy? The the company that makes Rogue Legacy, they pretty much haven't made anything else. Like, before that, they hadn't made anything else worthwhile. And they haven't made while. anything else since. But, I mean, that was just... It's such a gem. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty fantastic game. I really like that game. And, like, all their other titles have been... I don't know. They seem underwhelming. It's kind of crazy how they can just... Strike it. Just, I don't yeah, know. I think it's a lot harder to make a good game than, than people might think. It's oh, easy. Yeah, it's easy to judge games and sure, but even even a bad game takes a lot of work to make. Yeah, and even if nah, that sucks, I see this this question sometimes. People who know you're making a bad product, how do you feel when you're making it? Like if you're making a game with a with a development team and it yeah, and you it know it's feel bad. Right, yeah, it but sucks. You still have to try. Yeah, you, you know, do. You do the best you can. Yeah. Either, well, do I want the heart or the bomb? Probably the heart. You have to at least try. You'll never get better if you don't. Yeah, you, need, you know. The guy in charge needs to be needs to know what he's doing. Like that's to be to make a good game. Really, you have to have played so many games of so many different genres. I think, and you also or just have a good grasp of mechanics. Yeah, and have a good grasp of mechanics. But like, I find that playing board games. Yeah. And playing and playing video games and just having such a huge knowledge of of games. I mean video games seem to be an extension of board games in a lot of ways. Yeah, yeah it's it's the more the more different types of games I play and the more different games I play that for as yeah board games and and card games and video games that the more I realize that they're all very very similar. The more different things the more different games that I play the more that I realize that they're all <laughs> so they're all so similar. So how about this attack strategy? Yeah, it's working. It is working. Kind of surprised. Everything, everything kind of comes down to resource management and, <laughs> and the major and the constant resource is time. Yeah, there's yeah. It's like yeah. always time, and then there's other resources. <laughs> Jesus juice. My favorite. My favorite kind of juice is Jesus juice. Yeah, there's usually some sort of life counter in most games. Well, most games where you, most action games or 
or RPG games Crap. where you play as a character. Crap. Usually the character has some sort of a life counter. Yo, this so that's game. a resource that when it runs out the game ends. And then you've got another one like money. This has money. And you got bombs and ropes like in Spelunky. One goes up, one goes down. Faith up. And it's just balancing your resources. That's all any game is, more or less. Resource management, you know. Which is, I mean, it's practically limitless the amount of things you can do with just that concept, so it's not a bad thing at all. Why, how come these are oh, just dying very slowly? This is a crazy room. Yeah, this is a wide open one. I was thinking about bringing over some bulletproof coffee. But, oh, yeah. But you made the coffee before I was coming over, so. Yeah. Maybe next time I'll bring that over, Maybe though. Maybe next time. Do you still drink it a lot? Not really. Sometimes. Hey, look, they're friends. If I'm, like, really tired, I'll... They're helpful. Yeah, that's uh, that's our new sponsor, Bulletproof Coffee at BulletproofExec.com. <laughs> I didn't know that they were sponsoring us. When no, did, when did not, that happen? But, but uh, they make a good product. Is it marketing or is it real? Is it, like, actually worth it? It's good. It's better than what we're drinking. It's better coffee than what we're well, drinking right now. Well, yeah. But we're, we're drinking full <laughs> shit right now. Oh, I wasn't going to name them. No, I was. It's fine. I mean, I'm not like a hipster about coffee, but it is. It tastes better, and it, I feel better when I drink it than I do when I. But it's not. It's like a little bit better. You yeah. Know? It's not like hugely. It feels lucky. Do we want to feel lucky or faith up? And also, you put butter in it. That's the other thing. Yeah. You put butter and coconut oil what? in, in with the bulletproof coffee. What makes anything taste good? You have good. the ultimate. You have the ultimate in coffee. If you have like a good brand of coffee, it doesn't have ah. to be bulletproof coffee. You put some butter and some coconut oil in there, and you don't eat a, and you don't eat like a bunch of cake with it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you don't eat like pancakes or a bunch of sugar with it. Wait, what was down here? You're gonna fall asleep if you put sugar and oh. if you're eating like sugar and, and cake and hamburgers with your coffee. <laughs> but but if you just have some. Uh, if you just have the coffee with some butter and coconut oil in there, like I've said about 16 times now in a row. Look at this bomb. Yeah, what's going on with that? I think I have a detonator. Oh. Oh, no. I laid. How do oh, I. You probably would press the L uh, trigger to detonate. There How did you, you go. Know? Yeah. How did you know that? Because it's on the L trigger button. But it's on the R bumper to set the bomb. Yeah. L oh. bumper, L <laughs> bumper, and then. Oh, I see. I see. L trigger, yeah. L right. trigger to detonate. <laughs> You're right. I couldn't even think that through with my stupid little monkey brain. Yeah, you see, I'm the one doing talking. I'm the one using the higher brain, and you're using your lower brain. Clearly, clearly, I'm using my lower brain here. We I'm should call thinking. it. Uh, we should call it like the feeling brain or something, because it's, it's, it's. I don't know. I, the more I think about it, the more I think that it's a better brain. The lower the brain. The old brain. Yeah, the old brain. Like the newer brain. Well, it's all the evolution of the newer brain. It's. Well, I think it's better in some ways. But the, not in the, every way. the the old brain, the lower brain, has been in us for how long? How I don't know, like a million. How how old is the human More than race? That. A million years? Millions and millions, millions of years? Of millions, yeah. I, I don't even know. But I mean, it's been in there for a lot longer. The lower brain has yeah. been has been evolving for a lot longer, so it's much more advanced. I think eukaryotes are about two billion years old. So quite old. Yeah. It's two billion years of evolution. So, so the upper brain is is not as well is not as well evolved as the lower brain. So I really think that the lower brain is better. We just look down on it because we can't we can't control it as much or at all. Yeah. Yeah, we wish we could. It just I guess. tells us things. It gives us information and we react. Just go to the boss now. I don't want to go to the boss. Like it can it makes you good at Twitch. It makes you good at Twitch games. That's what Twitch gaming is. <laughs> but it's really. Like Twitch gaming is is just thinking faster. Ah. Uh, yeah, it's well, it's reflex reflexes. Right. And it's not even a game of skill. That's just a game of how fast does your brain process information. No, I think it's I think it's skill. It is skill though. Is reflex is having a reflex a skill? Yeah. I mean, everybody has reflexes. Yeah, I think so. Is it something you I, can develop? I, you, you can, like, the more you play a shoot 'em up game, or the more you play, like, a, an action game, you're just thinking faster. Mm -hmm. Like, a game like Hearthstone, you have time to think, or a game, like, the most basic example, chess, you have time to think about it. You have time to think out your moves. But really, it's the same as, like, playing a Street Fighter game. You just train your brain to be able to, to react. <laughs> you just 
train your brain. Yo, I can't, I can't get out of here. Yeah, this is this is this a is really, really bad. Really bad. Move. You did pretty well though. I don't like these guys, these bats. You're driving me nuts. Hmm, that kind of stunk. <laughs> yeah. This is a pretty bad room. You got nothing. You got nothing out of it, and you got beat up by some bats. I really need some hearts. Oh, this is gonna be the death of me. Oh, oh they okay. shoot maggots at you. At least it's not the the ones that shoot blood at you. At least, yeah. Some of them might shoot blood at you, though. I've been in a room where some of them shoot maggots and some oh, shoot blood sucks. in the last run. Yep. Oh, great! As if it wasn't enough. Yeah, one of them seems to shoot blood, and the rest seem to shoot maggots. Good. Look out. You don't maggots. know which is which. Yeah. This. Oh no, the ones with the maggot heads are the ones that are shooting maggots. Oh, okay. That, did you see that? Yeah, the ones without. Oh yeah, the ones without yeah. the maggots on their head are the ones that that shoot the blood. That's how it is. That's how you can tell them apart. Pretty simple. Yeah. Okay. okay I can can't kill even, those. I can't even hit no. them. Yeah, you just gotta move or maneuver around. There we. Great. Yeah, you're gonna get that. <laughs> this is a battle room. I don't really want to do a battle room because I'm not sure I can survive it. Okay. I think what if you can get to a point where you always beat this game? If you get to a point where you're just like really good at it? I don't know. I think it's. I mean, everything's random every single time. So there's gonna be instances where no matter how yeah, good even you the are, the best player is not yeah. gonna be able to to do it. Oh, why can't I get that? Why does this game insist on uh, being mean like that? You feel itchy. I just gained a heart though. <laughs> from being. Itchy. It seems like some of the power ups just give you an extra heart or give you some other benefits. No. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. Wait, is this... What? Oh. Okay. I wonder if there's a secret here. Oh, these guys. Ugh. Great. What's this? Nothing. I do like the troll bombs, though. You like them? You like the face on it? Yeah. Yeah. It's troll face, man. It's definitely troll face. Oh, come on, sir. <laughs> it's weird how these internet memes are, like, just poorly drawn. They're either, like, poorly drawn or, like, does, um... It's funnier Just that a way. photo. And then the photo has, like, a caption on the bottom. Yeah. Those are kind of dumb. I mean, they have to be simple, you know? Yeah, on, on Reddit, like, I turned off all the, all the like, funny and all the ones that just show all the memes. Oh, Because they're uh, such a waste of time. They're, like, never yeah. funny. Like, good they, guy... They are Good waste. guy Greg, is that one of them? Yeah. And there's the one, like, with the crazy girl. Yeah, they are a huge waste. And the, there's one with the duck or something. Like, they're entertaining, but you don't get They're a waste of out. time, and I never laugh at them. Hey, come here, fellas. Come here. Uh, good, uh, kiting there. Kiting? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, boom! Whoa, he exploded. I guess bombs are powerful. Yeah, you've only got, well, you got four left. Yeah. Yeah, you can probably finish this guy by himself yeah. without a bomb, though. I think these shots are a lot more powerful now. These tears. Yeah, get big bad boom. What's this? Torn Tears photo. Shot Tears. Speed. There you go. Wow. Yeah. How come you get all the good power ups? You get all the good power. You get oh, all the no, good I tier don't. power ups. And you, you manage to live longer though, usually. I don't know how. Yeah, so you get all the good power-ups, then give me the controller and I'll finish the run. Alright. No, just Wait, finish your run. Look at these shots, they're smaller now, aren't they? I think they're smaller. They yeah. look smaller. But look how fast you're shooting. I think it did get smaller. It's kinda weird. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. At least they sort of stay in a line. If they're clumped together, they're easier to dodge. But yeah. they seem to randomly change direction, so some of them start moving around, so you gotta kill them fast. Yeah, they have really strange behavior. <laughs> Strange behavior. Look at those. For this These game. ones are like dropping flies everywhere. God. And then I think the flies evolve into bigger flies. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> evolve into bigger flies. It's a weird. This, this whole game. Yeah, they do. They do evolve into bigger flies. We should stop saying that this game is weird. Yeah, I guess it's pretty apparent. Is this something you can attack? There we go. I don't even know which way to go. Ooh. Good choice. Bad, bad, bad Larry choice. Boom. The baddest man in the whole darn tomb. 
in the tomb. Yeah. What is this? This is really, truly a room with nothing? Shoot that thing. Maybe that flame does something. No. Nope. Truly a room with nothing in it. Yeah, there's gotta be like oh, a room with nothing in it. Oh my sometimes. god. Wow, this is, this is no good for Look you. Look at the speed of these monsters. These demons. Alright. It's not so bad. I like the sweet new dew that I got, though. Mountain Dew, I mean. Yeah, the character looks really weird with the... with the... with the Pope power up behind him with the light. You wanna see what it does? The pill? Yeah. It's just white. There's always white. Tears up! Okay, Tears up is good, but I would... I would... Yeah, I seem to get... I seem to get all the hearts, which I yeah. don't need as much. <laughs> HP up. Ah, uh, that's what I need. Yeah, that's what you... Definitely is what I need. I just want shot up. You want shot up? Yeah, you should... I like to get more offense powers in games because it helps you kill the guys faster so you yeah. have less chances of getting hit. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, speed up is great. But in Hearthstone, health is just as important as attack, if not more, on a minion. It's coming from magic where power, really only the power mainly matters on creatures. Oh my god, I got Which you. is the attack. Stuck in a corner. And the hit points, called the toughness in magic, doesn't really matter that much. But in Hearthstone, both matter. So let's continue talking about Hearthstone while we play the, while we play the Binding of Isaac. <laughs> Isaac. What is this? It's broken! Hmm. This lucky thing didn't seem to be too lucky. You got a lot of shot up, though. I did. Maybe I'll keep it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yeah, you're just dodging on the X and Y axis here. Yeah, yeah like, like it's nothing. But it is something. It is. Uh, this, wow, this is... greed guy shows up quite a bit. He's pretty greedy. Hey, I think he's taking my money. Taking me money. Did he take your money? Maybe he dropped money. I can't really tell. I think he dropped money. He's greed, though. I'm pretty sure... I don't know. Maybe he stole from someone else. At least there's a lot of money. All right. This is a pretty big level. No. Is it a labyrinth level? I don't think so. No. Hmm. That's it. Nothing. What there is it? It's amazing. It's fucking nothing. <laughs> there's, wasn't that a gif or something? Yeah. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. I guess some of those are pretty funny. I remember old Dolan. Old Dolan. I don't Gooby, have key. and he's saying Gooby, please, and that old. So we only the first one was funny on that one. So yeah, you, you're gonna have to take damage to get any of this shit. Yeah, we're gonna have to take four, four damage. A lot of that damage. Not to get worth any of it. it. Probably not worth it. No. Unless there's some ability to let you walk over spikes. We should probably uh, call the video after this. I'm not sure how long we've been going. Yeah, I think we've been going for a pretty good amount of Quite time. Some time. It's been a pretty great episode, though. Well, yeah, we had some interesting chat. Okay, there was a boss room somewhere around here. Here it is. Yeah, 17 minutes. I like how it has that timer. I, don't, I haven't even been keeping track of what uh, floor we're on or anything. I don't even know where we are. Carrion Queen. That's cool. Uh, I guess you can only hit her in the butt. Seems like, like it. At least you got pretty powerful shots. Oh, okay. You got bombs. Oh, you are right. Oh, those things hurt you if you touch them. That's hmm. unfortunate. Yeah, I do have bombs. Come on! Oh, this is pretty, did it, did this it, a decent chunk. Did it? I didn't even, yeah. I didn't even get to see it. Huh. It's, it's kind of hard to damage her. Yeah, it seems that way. It seems a little bit frustrating because she's always facing you. Yeah. She... Oh, that's the I queen. queen, yeah. Ah, oh, Jesus. Jesus! You gotta like angle your shots a little bit. So pretty much, whenever she encounters you on the X or Y axis, she's just going to immediately beeline for you. Yeah. So that's the strategy, I guess. Is, so at least you can avoid it. You know exactly when she's gonna start attacking. Uh, oh, well, maybe not. She's changed the pattern. Does seem like it. Now she's just <laughs> okay. Like a, like a near death pattern. Here. Yeah. This must be it. Yeah. Near death pattern. Yeah. Exactly. Well, this is scary. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> that was interesting. <laughs> 
Interesting hitbox there. Oh, there was like one more hit. Come on, come on. Yeah! Give me those hearts. Matches. Evil Up. <laughs> cool. Is Evil Up, does that always just give you some stuff? Some items or something? I don't know. Seems like you always get some stuff with your Evil Up. It does. These just... Look, they just keep popping up. That's kind of weird. Don't stand on that one. Then. Oh, I didn't see it. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> Fantastic. Depths. Can we make some more coffee? It's up to you. I uh, I don't usually drink coffee this late. It's uh. Oh yeah. Seven o'clock. Yeah, I'll be all right. I mean, cause you stay up till like two or three in the morning usually, don't you? Yeah. Somewhere around there. Yeah. Yeah. I usually uh. Get in bed pretty much when we're finished. You're a morning. Yeah, definitely a morning person. Well, it's because of my stupid cat, which we don't feed. <laughs> no, <laughs> no that was me that doesn't feed. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. I do feed my cat. Yeah. That's but why he gets you up That's why, you yeah. gotta stop feeding him. He's, his, Look how fast your his, shots are. They are pretty fast. We've trained his brain to uh, wake us up. See all that, that lower brain conditioning? Oh, we've conditioned him to wake us up like I wonder, do cats only have a lower brain? No. Do they no. have a? They, they have, have enough of a brain they can think? Yeah, of course. They can play Hearthstone? <laughs> I don't think they can play Hearthstone, but they... I mean, crows can learn. Crows crows are really smart. I thought they were bird brains. Yeah, bird, birds are, in general, pretty smart, I think. I mean, there's, there's a lot about the, the bird brain that is... Hey, look. Boom. Uh, can't kill these guys. Nah. It's true, man. It's true. You know, crows can stand on uh, traffic lights, and they can drop nuts onto the road because they know that when cars drive over the nuts, the shells will crack. Yeah, yeah, I know about that. It's pretty genius, if you ask me. Jeez, I'm not even smart enough to think of that one. <laughs> what is this? Looks like a map of the whole level, maybe? Maybe. Not 15 really. cents, though, for it's one a... stinking map? Maybe it's a map I of every level. I would get the blue level. heart, though. It's probably a map of every level, then, if it costs 15. You could try it. Give if, it a shot. If 16. I'll do it. Full visible. Oh, it shows treasure. So that's that's actually worth it. Provided I don't die right now. Yeah, I could use a break. Yeah, me too. Stand up. We've been playing this for some some hours. You wanna hours? You wanna pause it and come back to it? No, nah, no. Nah, let's just let's finish this run. I'm definitely I'm definitely into it enough to see you uh, finish this run here. Oh, heart. All right. Well, this is the boss room. Wait, there's a ton of this that we haven't explored yet. Yeah. We. I say we. Nintendo. Nintendo? Nintendo. Oh, Nintendo Wii. <laughs> Come on. Yo. Whoa, that was just, you got hit twice yeah. there. Hey, look. My shots are bigger when apparently when I take in damage or something? Maybe. It seems that way, yeah. It does seem like it. Okay, they jump. Yeah, it's really powerful. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Yeah, those things are... That's obnoxious. You can go on the bottom. If you go on the bottom, you'll... On the bottom? Well, yeah, just to dodge. Come on. Come on. There we go. Yeah, give me those hearts. Or maybe it's the number of soul... Like, uh, soul hearts you have. Those armor hearts. I don't know. I haven't, uh... I don't know. What's yeah, this? Maybe. Laser tears. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Well, your tears are laser now. But are they as powerful it's as they were before? It's probably weak though. Probably. Oh, I didn't mean to go in here. Oh, I don't have any keys anyway. Bummer. Well, if it's as powerful as the other one, I guess it's okay. Oh. Seems. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> seems, seems good enough. It does seem. does seem pretty powerful. Yeah, it seems pretty powerful. I'll take that. Yeah, maybe it, maybe it just adds the laser property to whatever the power level you had was. Yeah, seems like it. Yeah, it must. It must. Because the laser that you had was really weak. Yeah. But that was also like a secondary laser. That wasn't your main attack. Yeah. Oh, this is nothing. Is there anything on the other side of that? No. No. Why would I even go in there? No. All right, let's go to the boss, shall we? There's a coin over there. Sure is. We'll see what boss that it is. 
Who do you think it's going to be? We're not at the, the end, Reaper. are we? The Reaper. War. I haven't seen this guy. I haven't seen this guy. This seems like a serious, like a significant boss. Like we fought greed, lust, now we oh, have yeah. war. Well, it's very war-y, I guess. Yeah, he seems he's similar to another boss that we fought a couple of times in a previous episode. Oh, he falls off of his high horse, though. Sure does. He's got that... He looks like, uh... What does he look like? He's got that evil face. Uh, Red Whoa. Skull. Maybe. Is that a ball of band-aids? It looks like it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, cool. All right. I don't know what that does, but... Seems I'll neat. I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, look. Let's uh, go make a deal with the devil. What do you think that does? It's a heart. Let's do it. Bloody friend. Oh, he drops blood. Blood hurts guys, right? So yeah. maybe that's Hopefully DOT. it doesn't hurt you. Yeah. I hope. Great. Oh, hey, you look. The, the map is visible. Oh, you still have the map. Oh, I guess that map. Yeah, the map probably is worth it then. Gives you a full map of yeah, everything. Totally worth it. But I guess not secret areas, though. Mm, yeah. So you would see it. But you can sort of tell where the secret areas are gonna be. Yeah. You need, oh, you got 11 bombs, so. Those purple ones shoot at you. Shoot bullets at you. Uh, so how are you gonna get through? Be careful about this TNT though. I don't know how to get. Well, I guess we could just bomb in here. Yeah, just but bomb in. Do we want to even kill it? What's the point? I guess you got lasers, look. right? Yeah. Do they shoot through? They don't shoot through the rocks though. Oh crap. Oh, okay. This better be worth it. Where? A key. <laughs> That's all you get. Not worth it. They gotta get out of here. Whoa. Okay, so the enemies are definitely getting a lot more challenging. Yeah, I, there's a lot of soul, uh, like those gray hearts dropping. Yeah, it seems that way. You're barely losing any red hearts because you keep getting those those gray ones. Which is great. Purple, gray, blue. Whatever they are. Yeah, there's some color that isn't... That isn't really? Red. Cost two bombs and you get all that? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, seems good. You get more bombs. There's no reason not to. I guess if it was ran, you know, it's randomized, so you might not get any bombs, then you'd have to say, well, I don't know if it's worth it. Maybe I want to keep my bombs. Hmm. Well, you don't need the heart. You don't really need the bombs wow. either. No. I guess there's nothing to get here. Save the cash. This guy's got money in his store. Didn't even realize it. What a chump. Oh wait, there is another room down there if you wanna Yeah. Take a look. Oh no, boss! Oh god. Well that's a lot of trouble. Oh my god. Cool. Two of Oh, I think this gives you double keys or double bombs? Hmm. One of the two. I'm gonna guess bombs. I hope it's bombs. It's bombs. <laughs> oh, is it? Twenty-four bombs. Double your bombs. Yeah. Great. Never have to worry about bombs again. Oh wait, there was uh there's more in this room. There's this. <laughs> well at least it did blow up those bombs. Yeah, you I trade know. two keys for I wouldn't even do that. No. I only got two keys. We don't need bombs. More? Another one like Wait. That? What? Mm, did you see that? It's a maze. It's like a like a Zelda maze. But but why? How? How did that even happen? Why did it change? It is a maze. It did say curse of the maze. It's kind of hard to tell what blood's yours and what's theirs. Yeah. Well, theirs is like a shimmer. Yeah. yeah. Look, this is where we were. All right, maybe I'll just try to keep going here. That was a weird one. Mm-hmm. At least we can attack these guys now. Cool, more bombs. Just what the doctor ordered. More explosions. Split shot! Oh, hmm. it probably doesn't do anything because we have lasers. Yeah. Alright. Oh god! Whoa! Green. Oh, that was confusing. 
There's so much on. There's so much going on right now. I know. You got so many power ups. I wonder what this pill does. It's a white pill again. Again. It looks yellow. Once, oh, yeah, one side got, is like speckled. One side's like a little bit. Yeah. I think whatever color a certain pill is, it stays that color and does the same thing for the entirety of one run. So if we get the same color pill, we'll know what it does. I think it tells you too. Oh um, really? Yeah. It's different each run then? I think so, yeah. Hmm. I tried to look it up, like, if, if certain colors are associated with certain effects, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Oh, you know what we should be doing? I should be bombing everywhere and looking for secret rooms. Yeah, you do have 25 bombs. There's one resource that you had a lot of. It's bombs. I can't get in there. Let's see, maybe there's one Could here. Could be there, yeah. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I would like... I guess I can't get any more hearts. Let's try, uh... Try in here. No, we can't. I'm gonna try a bomb there. I guess you could have done it from the other side. Oh no, uh -oh. we gotta fight mom! Just keep moving. You're pretty powerful. Not yeah. as powerful as the last time you were here, but. Isaac? I'm not Isaac. Yeah, probably only recorded oh, the one track. This is a tough fight. What? I'm gonna lose again. I don't understand this fight. I guess you just gotta keep moving. I guess. Ah, oh, what? Oh, it's just the hand came out of the door up there. Sure did. Man, this game is tough. I agree. Let's take a break, shall we? Yeah. Thanks for watching Game Soup.